good morning, good afternoon, good night, depending on your location or where you are watching from. This is Stranger News Channel. If this is your first time in this channel, kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more content. And don't forget to like, share, and drop your comments in the comment section below. Without wasting much of your time, let's go straight to the news for today. Today news. Security operatives killed for suspected kidnappers in Anambra. You know, our common saying in this channel is, every day for the thief, one day for the owner. Remember in one of the news, I said, no matter how smart you are, one day you will be caught. Just like the way they also caught these ones now and killed them. You will also be caught or you might also be killed. So, disease from evil activity, whether kidnapping or stealing, snatching of phones or whatever, disease. Because one day, you will surely be caught. Security operatives in Anambra State have killed for suspected kidnappers who specializes in terrorizing motorists and residents along the Mpo Umoji Indiani Road in the state. The Anambra Vigilante Group, in collaboration with the police, were said to have carried out the operation on the criminal gang on Sunday after a charge by the state governor, Professor Chukuma Soludo. This is according to a press statement by the state governor's press secretary, Christian Aburime, in Aqua on Tuesday. Aburime stated that the governor had also warned criminals operating in the Aziz to desist or be ready to meet their Waterloo from the security forces who have taken over the Aziz to protect and safeguard the citizens. The statement read, the gang of kidnappers who had hitherto terrorized the innocent citizens along the Mpo Umoji Indiani Aziz paid dearly with their lives when security forces acting on intelligence reports swooped on the areas and after an intense combat to effectively dispatch four of the deadly criminals to the great beyond and also made some arrests. It will be recalled that Governor Chukuma Soludo has repeatedly warned that there is no space for any criminalities in Anambra State. Hence, zero tolerance has been declared by the governor on any form of criminal activities in the state. It will also be recalled that the governor, on the assumption of the office within a short period of time, successfully reduced kidnapping and other criminalities in the state to be to the barest minimum. Based on this, on this success, Governor Soludo had received continuous commendations from Indianambra, that is the Anambra people, for reclaiming the state from the firm grip of deadly criminals who have now turned criminalities into a profitable enterprise. Aburime added that after successful neutralizing the kidnappers, rather Aburime added that after successfully neutralizing the kidnappers, the security operatives recovered a Lexus sport utility vehicle and some sophisticated weapons, including charms tied around their waists. He also disclosed that those arrested are currently cooling off in detention and are helping the security agencies in their investigation to unravel the whereabouts of other kidnappers who are in the run. So you are listening to this news now. Maybe you are one of them. I want to assure you that one day you will surely be caught. Why not desist? Every day for the thief, one day for the owner. Even if you succeed for one year, for 10 years, for how many years you can say, one day you will surely be caught and that day you will pay dearly for it. So this is, this is the news for today, my people. I don't know what is your take on this matter, this incident that happened at Anambra, killing four suspected kidnappers. You can kindly drop your opinion in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. 
This is Strange News Channel. Thank you very much for listening. Bye for now.